What's up everybody, it's up to my cheap today so I'm going to be reviewing Outlanders. This is a one episode anime series and it is 51 minutes long. First thing I want to talk about are the characters. The characters were funny, cool, and I loved them. First character I want to talk about is Calm. Calm, she was a cool princess that loves to have fun and she would defend her loved one, Tetsuya, from any danger that comes his way. She also enjoys having fun and breaking the rules of that sets uh, in place, especially uh, marriage related rules for her. And overall, it was a fun adventure to see how she does many things to try to avoid all of that. She was a funny and great girl, and Ho and Tetsuya were my favorite characters. Next character I want to talk about is Tetsuya. Oh man, Tetsuya. I would say, you know, he was a nice guy that is talented in fighting and getting kidnapped. He is shy around beautiful with ladies and loves and desires nothing more than sex. <laughs> he was also a guy to over-exaggerate depending the situation he is in and these were some funny moments of his which I loved. He was a he was great you know I liked his story and how he deals with the craziness that comes his way throughout this anime. Next character I want to talk about is Patea. Bat Patea. Patea. Now she was a cool wolf girl who also is skilled in fighting. She's the best friend of Calm and she has a this is like towards Tetsuya, the guy she plans to marry. I love the way Batia and Kam walks, you know, how they walk after differences in a friendly fight, like friendly rival fight. It is really great and overall I think she's really cool and she has a cool design as well. Now the next character I want to talk about is Nayo and Momo. Now I'm gonna put these together because they were, they were comedic, you know, and they're like a duo, wait. Com comedic duo, yes. They were cool friends and servants of Princess Calm. They are respectful and love to help out Calm and support her when needed. Uh, in times they could be really funny along. Also when the, what was it, the kids are involved in the scenes. That also um, has a lot of funny scenes. So overall let's say this is like a little family, this duo of them two and how they deal with the children. They were overall like small funny things which made it even better, you know, certain moments. You never know what's going to happen with these, this little family of theirs. And also, <laughs> they also have purported kids that love to just watch Calm and Tetsuya when they are having the best moments of their lives. So, yeah. <laughs> the other characters were also funny and they also have cool designs. Now, next thing I want to talk about is the music. The music was done in a great way, but I would say, you know, it has like this uprising way, which I would say makes for some fun party like music, and I love it. You know, the outro has a guitar rhythm, which I love, the nice and cool drum beats, and the singer sounded great. Overall, I think this anime has really cool music. Now, the story is about a, uh, is about Calm. She planned it to invade Ord and during the attack she comes upon Tetsuya, a guy who is taking a picture of all of this craziness that's happening around him while being scared of, uh, of the, all the dead bodies that is well all over the town he lives in he plans to just go around while taking pictures he discovers calm and as she attacks him, he takes a picture of her and the flash blinds her temporarily. Enough time is given for him to kind of chase her and kind of restrain her from killing him. So while he is holding her, he notices that she has a cute body. And she notices that he, he's pretty cool himself and she ends up kissing him. And from here, she falls in love with him and... Tetsuo being surprised that she understands his language, she decides to knock him out and kidnap him and take him to her spaceship. As he wakes up, he is on her spaceship and finds out that she is calmed and Vedal's princess. And she picked up Tetsuo as her groom so she can help save his planet from being annihilated by her family. And yeah, from here we just see their adventures. It's all out of funny story and really great overall anime. Now one of the things that I was thinking about afterwards while watching this anime is, you know, 
I would have loved it if it was longer because these characters could have done so much more but they are used in a great way despite it being not as long as I wanted to be and I am happier because of that and you know this is one of those instances where you know despite it not having like a huge series or you know something like hey you know it's a one time thing I'm happy that it happened you know it's a really fun anime to watch and I'd say it's one of my favorite enemies of all time. I truly loved it. It was fun. <laughs> now, the last thing that I want to talk about is that there are many great classic animes, and Outlanders is one of those unrated animes that I don't hear talked a lot about. And in my opinion, that, that sucks because this is really a fun anime with a lot of crazy, funny things going on, and I loved it all. You know, I don't want to spoil this anime because I think. You know, due to its being short time, I think a lot of times, um, you know, if you view it yourself, I want, I don't want to take that away. So overall, I'd say, you know, Orlando's, I loved it. You know, I love the characters. I love how they are funny, they're cool. The music is enjoyable. The story was great and interesting. And overall, I recommend watching Orlando's. It is one of my favorite animes of all time. Now, the animes that I recommend watching. Uh, Dragon Hat because oh wow, yeah, you know, it also has a cool, funny Dragon Girl Mink, and it follows her adventures in a really cool world with her funny friends that are also fun to watch. And Space Family called Vincent because it also has aliens and their adventures there with humans. I mean, with their human daughter, and it's like a really cute and cool anime overall. So. I would say, you know, all three animes are really great, and I love them. I highly recommend watching all three of them. Yeah. So with that being that, I hope you enjoyed the video. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe, and until next time, bye.